Hi, darlings. Welcome back to Look What Meg Found. I am really excited to be here. If you do not know me because you're new to the channel, I am Meg Campbell. I am the host of Look What Meg Found. I am a small business owner, so I spend 90% of my weekends going to shows to set up to sell my own products. And when you live that life, you create friends and network within that community. So I find people who make amazing items that I really think that you all should see. They deserve a much broader platform so that everyone can see them. So my goal here is to bring you the items that I find that I think the whole world needs to see. So come along with me while I show you what I found today. I have Heritage Beadworks and I... I'm in awe of her technical skill because the skill to do what she does is beyond anything that I can do. Absolutely beyond. And she does beautiful, stunning work. Everything I'm going to show you is hand beaded. There is no form. Well, I take that back. This particular pair of earrings are on an ear wire. But most of what I show you is completely hand done. It is. There is no... Now, on this bracelet, this is not done around a form. This is completely hand beaded, and I absolutely love it. We'll start with this piece since I have it in my hand. This is a hand beaded seed bead and glass pearl woven bracelet. These are absolutely stunning. And fun feature, the clasp on this is a slide clasp so that it will slide together. And it's very secure. Most of the time when I see those clasps, I'm worried that they will come apart. And they don't. This one is very secure, stays very well, and does not slide easily, which, I mean, we've all had that bracelet. It helps take my fingers out of the way. We've all had that bracelet that you love, that you're terrified to wear because the clasp will come undone. Not the case with this. But this is all tiny little seed beads and glass pearls. It also has a matching set, if I can get my fingers to cooperate. It has a matching set of earrings that go with it. So this whole thing is a coordinated piece. And I, I mean, just the technical skill that goes into doing this is phenomenal. You guys aren't going to believe that this piece, when I show it to you, is done without a form. This is all, like I said, completely done by hand, put together. This is a, let me make sure I have this right, lily pad bracelet. Every single one of these clusters is individual beads that have been beaded together. And don't ask me how, because like I said, this technical skill is so far beyond me. But it is a stunningly beautiful piece. It is a bracelet. It has the traditional ring clasp that goes together like this. Again, extremely secure, which when you're dealing with hand beaded pieces, I would be terrified if it did not have that kind of clasp that I know is secure, I would be terrified to wear it. Let me grab the next piece. These are, this particular set of earrings is made with seed beads, crystals, and super duo beads, and they're all woven together. But look at the shape that she was able to get. And again, there is no underlying form that the beads are wrapped around. This is all just completely hand beaded. Let me get you a better picture of that. These I can show you on video all day long, but until you get them in your hands, you are not going to realize just how incredible they are. This set of earrings blows my mind. These are seed beads in a woven lace pattern, but look how tiny these beads are and look how finely done it is. Again, this is not done over a form. This is done completely by hand. And obviously there are two earrings in that set. It's just hard to show you two at the same time.
the last pair I am in love with, these may be going in my personal collection because these are on an ear wire. So they wear extremely well. They're wrapped around the wire. Let me get these set so you guys can really see it. They're wrapped around the wire and they've got just a little bit of fun at the end with the glass crystals that dangle. But what's key to me on these is they're lightweight. These are not heavy. None of this jewelry is extremely heavy, which is a big thing with me personally in jewelry. These, this is a small business that started out as a hobby that then grew from being a hobby into being a business. I am checking my notes. I'm not going to lie, guys. I do these off notes because I do not want to mess up and tell you the wrong thing. Laura's focus on this business is being able to customize to what you want, what you need. So you know you need a hand-beaded piece of jewelry or you know you want a hand-beaded piece of jewelry. You can contact her and say, okay, I like this style, you know, and I'm going to use examples. You know, I really like this style that you did, but I want it in teal. That's completely doable because everything can be done as a custom order for you. So all of her information on how to contact Laura at Heritage Beadworks is linked below. That way you can get in contact with her and get started on your own journey of having your own hand beaded jewelry because, like I said, the technical skill it takes to do this kind of work is so far beyond anything I can do myself. I absolutely adore it. So if you like what you see, don't forget to click the subscribe button and I am off to find you guys something else cool to check out. I will see you guys on the next episode. Bye guys.